for a wet and gloomy just unfortunately continues to be the trend we have been seeing and will continue to see at least through our day today as thanks to the slow pressure system is finally starting to move out of the area so it's in over Ontario and Quebec the past couple of days but now it's starting to shift a little bit more to the southeast that's thanks to the high pressure that's currently starting to build up across the Great Plains right now currently across Nebraska We'll start to continue, well, we'll continue to move east. We'll finally start to push the slow pressure out. So the rain showers, even a couple snowflakes that we're seeing this morning are finally gonna start to shift on out of the valley, actually leaving us with sunshine for the next couple of days. Though it will take a little bit for that sunshine to build back in, just trickling in a little bit each day. Maybe a very brief period of sunshine today, but really much of that's gonna come far down Friday. And as we head into the weekend, good news, with that sunshine, we're going to see temperatures back on the rise. So still have to deal with chilly today and tomorrow, but by Friday back to the 60s and then likely the 70s throughout the weekend and the beginning of next week. The good news with those temperatures is that's likely to going to be the trend we're going to see for at least the next couple weeks. Climate Prediction Center does have us at a 50 to 70 percent chance over the next two weeks of seeing temperatures above average. Our average is 68, so this just means multiple days, so longer stretch temperatures that likely will be in the 70s that really will begin for a day on Saturday. Though for now we're stuck with temperatures on the chilly side currently 37 here in Wheeling with a warm spot of 40 down to St. Mary's and our cool spot of 35 up in Carrollton. So once again just likely we'll need a light coat or a thicker jacket as you step out the door this morning. But really not not a bad idea to have that umbrella as well. So just starting off with a couple spotty showers even seeing a couple pockets where we're seeing some snowflakes mixed in even with that, all those showers will remain mainly just rain. By the time we get to noon, lunchtime though, we see those showers pick up intensity just a little bit, likely leaving us with just some light widespread showers as we step throughout the afternoon. Though by the time we get to dinner, we see most of those showers actually start to wrap up, but notice all these little pockets of clearing. Not everyone will see the sunshine, but a good chance that much of us will see at least a couple pockets of sunshine throughout our day today even more likely for a day tomorrow. So as we start the day tomorrow, seeing just a little bit of drizzle in some spots, still holding on to those clouds, but we will start to see things clearing out during the afternoon. So by lunchtime tomorrow, temperatures will start to get back up into the 50s, and we'll actually see skies starting to clear out throughout the day. So by the time we get to dinner and sunset tomorrow, really right on back to that sunshine, and this is likely just gonna be the trend that we're gonna see for the next couple of days. So that just means plenty of sunshine, with temperatures just a little bit warmer each day. Even today, we saw temperatures yesterday in the mid 40s, but likely getting up to 49 here in Wheeling with our warm spot of 51 down to Moundsville, as well as St. Mary's and our cool spot of 49 to Steubenville here in Wheeling, New Martinsville, as well as Woodfield and in through Caddis. That's just likely gonna be the trend over the next couple of days. Just a little bit of that drizzle tomorrow, temperatures back into the upper 50s, even into the 60s by the time we get to our feel good Friday. But look at that weekend though. Plenty of sunshine, mostly sunny, and temperatures back into the 70s. 73 on Saturday, 75 on Sunday, even possibly hitting the upper 70s with a stray shower for a day on Monday. 76 with a couple thunder showers possible for a day on Tuesday.